We talked about my favorite Nintendo games, my favorite Super Nintendo games, my favorite PlayStation games, but now it's time to go back to my favorite old school PC games with my favorite DOS games. So for those of you who have no idea what DOS is, DOS is an acronym that stands for Direct Operating System. It's what was used to run programs before Windows came about. So I remember having to either use a program where you have to use arrow keys to find the game I wanted to play and load, or go into DOS itself and type in load whatever the name of the file is .exe. So let's begin. Who remembers sitting down at your old PC, or in my case, Apple II computers at school and loading up the age-old game Oregon Trail? The simple charm of this game is what I love about it. I remember at school, instead of trying to finish the game, me and my friends would see how long it would take to kill everyone off. Lemmings was one of those games that had a bit of a story to how it came out. Basically, they all started when they created the little character and it went from there. I will link a video on how it all began from Lazy Game Reviews in the description. Anyway, this is one of those fun puzzle games where you had to try to bring a horde of lemmings from one end of the screen to the other. With each of them, you could assign a different job to help them out. But the best part is when you're totally frustrated, you click the self-destruct button and watch every one of your lemmings just explode into nothingness. Wolfenstein 3D was the first first-person shooter game I ever played. It was one of my favorite shooter games when it came out. I have a video of the history of shooter on, I will link down in the description down below. The idea of playing Sergeant BJ Blasco is trying to escape a Nazi prison is awesome. The full version of this game has you make your way to fight Robo Hitler. I grew up playing SimCity the first game as a kid, and I grew to love the rest of the game. But SimCity 2000 is one of my favorites. The whole idea of building a city and then if you want to destroy it completely by a series of disasters is just pure solid fun to me. Finally, let's end with one of the longest running games ever, Duke Nukem 3D. This was one of the first times I've ever played a Duke Nukem game. Then I realized that the franchise started out as a platform. I think Duke's catchphrases are just one of the charms of this game. Another thing I love about this game is how it aged over the years. Every version of the game has added charm to the game as well. Well, except for Duke Nukem Forever, that game was total garbage to me. Well, there you have it, some of my favorite DOS games. The clunky charm of DOS games is what I love about them. They're fun to play and even more fun to collect if you can find them in the box and in good condition. If you've ever played DOS games, let me know what your favorite one is down in the comments below. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button and notification bell so you're notified of my next video. Again, I am Paul Singh. Peace out and stay frosty.